All right, well, I'm here in Leesburg fishing on my kayak. And it's a very foggy day, as you can see. And it's gonna be really warm today, so we'll see how this goes. So stay tuned. Yeah, I got one already. Little guy. But I broke the ice first cast. Whoa, 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 whoa. And I gotta admit, this is a little fish. But it's a fish. Went on Lake Harrison, the tracker, the other day, and only caught one fish all day. Okay, I'm changing the swim bait from this thing to this thing. And then I have some other swim baits as well, which I'm going to try. A little bigger than this one, but this one was in my boneyard, so I'll try it. I think these did very well here, if I remember. There's an alligator right in the grass over there. Yeah, I have a weight. I thought this was fishing a little deeper. I have a weight in this one. Which is good. A little bigger. Probably still not a keeper though. Yeah, just like a little. Let's see, we got about 11, 11 and a half. Oh, should have shown it to you. Sorry. Next time. Oh, here's a splash. Got another one. Yep. Oh, that's a nice one. It's a little nicer, I think. This one might be a keeper. Oh, come on, don't go 
be in here, that's where the fish are. I think this is a, probably 12 inches at least. Yeah, just like 12 and a half. Yeah, almost 13. Nice fish. I knew this area would produce fish and I didn't want to put that in there. So you can still you see it's still foggy out. It's all right, 9:15. I think I've been here maybe. I don't know. Hour and a half. Hour, and it's still foggy. I caught three fish. One was a keeper, and it's gotten slow. Not really marking anything. So they got to be close to sure. I had. Maybe three that jumped down, jumped at the lure as I was pulling it through some lily pads that they missed. So I'm going to try a few more spots here. I'm not going to fish long today, I got too much to do. But I needed to get out because I knew it was going to be a nice day. And it's not hot at all. It's only 66 degrees according to my watch. So. It's in Citrus Ridge, wherever that is. So there's a couple of spots here I've caught fish before. It's not as productive as I thought it would be, but this time of year, and I didn't see that many beds. I saw one bed. There are areas, and I'm not going to go too far where the beds usually are. Uh, well, actually where I was, there used to be a lot of beds, but there were, they used to have beds next to each other Looked like the top of a golf, looked like the surface of a golf ball. There were so many beds. But uh, not today. I don't know where they are. It's 70 degrees. It's one day after the new moon, two days after the new moon. So fish should be hungry. No nightlight for them to fish to eat with. So let's keep it going for at least another hour and 15 minutes. swim bait again. It's probably a keeper, I think. Let's see. Yeah, it's only a, yeah, 12 inches, just about. So I'll show you what I'm catching on. I'm in an area here I never fished here before, and I think uh, it's like a little cove. And what happened was there was, I guess, vegetation kill with this, the frost we had in uh, December and there's a lot of dead stuff around and it opened up a ch like a channel. It's um, six, six feet in here so you can see the fishermen put it in right down to the bottom. So I'll just show you around a little bit. Yeah a lot of stuff is dead. Let's try to catch another one in here. All right, so I'm using this swim bait, which seems to be working. And I got it weighted with a little male, male weight in the, in the nose. Let's try a few more casts. 